as the city of East Hampton has proposed a debt exclusion for the construction of a pre-kindergarten through eighth grade combined school building to replace our current three elementary school buildings and middle school buildings. Whereas current elementary buildings are each over or nearly over 100 years old, years, out of compliance with current education regulations, costing the city many tax dollars to repair and maintain with the Maple Street School being one of the oldest schools in the Commonwealth. Whereas Whitebrook Middle School is in disrepair, inefficient, not conducive to teaching and learning with a poorly designed layout and has chronic issues with basic systems that directly impact students. Whereas conditions in current school buildings are unhealthy for our children, not in line with educational standards, and not compatible with 21st century teaching and learning. Whereas the entire East Hampton community will benefit from a school with modern design, larger cl classrooms, and improved facilities for the education of our students and the use of the community. Whereas improving our schools is an investment in the future of education in East Hampton by decreasing our loss to school choice and charter and to establish the East Hampton school system as a premier school precinct in the region. Whereas the quality education that residents have been getting in East Hampton for years are a result of dedicated, qualified, caring, and exceptional teachers, administrators, and staff, in spite of outdated school buildings and limited facilities. Whereas our investment in a new school today is an investment in the future of our city and can support students, families, residents, and help overall positive growth in our community. Whereas our role as municipal officials is not only to legislate, but to be leaders in our community. Therefore, be it resolved that the members of the East Hampton City Council support the pre-K-3 building proposal wholeheartedly, helping residents understand the impact, financial and otherwise, as well as providing positive support of the ballot process. Second. I would ask for a roll call vote, please. Yes. Okay. Yes. Absolutely. <laughs>